Do you love the Flash? I love the Flash. The Flash, the Flash, the Flash. The Flash is just so awesome right now. I think that the Flash, as a character, has done so much justice on his TV show on the CW. Definitely give it a look-see and check it out. But that's not all this video is about. Honestly, we gotta talk about the season two finale, more specifically, the last part of it. But before we get to that, let's just talk about the season two finale as a whole. So, honestly, it was awesome. There was callbacks to characters and other things. Zoom has brought, has brought the justice in a kind of interesting way, a way I didn't actually think that was going to happen, but hey, it happened. I think that it was really awesome. So, basically, watch the season two finale. I'm not gonna spoil it all for you here, but yay, watch it, definitely. Watch it, pray to it. I'm just kidding, but anyways, uh, most specifically, back to the point I was talking about. At the end of the season 2 finale, Barry goes back in time to save his mother from being killed by Eobarthon, aka the Reverse Flash, his worst enemy. And in doing so, as he does invokes what we know as Flashpoint in the comics. Now, if you don't know what Flashpoint is, let me give you a quick rundown. So, pretty much, Barry goes back in time, saves his mother from Reverse Flash, and she is... And she's alive in the in this like new timeline he's created where Balan no longer gets his powers because his mother's still alive and he's powerless and the whole world is being plunged into chaos to Aquaman and Wonder Woman both having some issue or problem not going to get into all that but having some kind of issue or problem they're getting ready to destroy the world because they are having a hissy fit and all the Justice League is pretty much disbanded and everyone else is slightly different in their character like Superman being a skinny uh, man who has no social skills whatsoever and uh, Cyborg being like this agent for the President of the United States. It's all pretty awesome. I think you guys should really check it out. So basically, Barry has to go back in time and stop himself from saving his mother from the Reverse Flash so that time may be restored to normal and in doing so, he now accepts his mother's death but inadvertently creates the New 52 timeline. That's an entirely different subject altogether but let's get back into what I'm talking about here. So basically, in this show, they're pretty much doing Flashpoint for season three. At least, most likely, that's what they're going to be doing. Because Barry saves Reverse Flash, saves his mother from Reverse Flash, I have to say, he pretty much has doomed the world in ways I'm not sure exactly how they're going to do it. Because Wonder Woman, Aquaman, they don't use those characters yet. They're in the movies, and usually, they don't let you know DC doesn't let their characters that are going to be in movies be used in a TV show. But we'll see how it goes anyway. Maybe they can come up with some like kind of uh, substitute characters. But right now. I'm not sure exactly how all this Flashpoint stuff is going to go down, but most likely it's going to go down in a similar way where the world's going to be destroyed and uh, Barry's mother is going to be half, he's going to have to go back in time and stop himself from saving his mother again and on, kind of put season one and two back into focus because in doing so, if we realize at the end of season one, that's just season two, Barry actually looks to the side and sees that his season one counterpart that was also there from the season one finale he disappears into nothing and that's actually really wow that is actually means that season one and two never happened so well that's going to be the pretty much like a plot point in the season three and going forward so we don't have no idea exactly how flashpoint's going to happen but we have an idea that a flashpoint like event is going to happen but i can't wait to see that so yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. It's a really quick one. I think I was talking really fast, but I think that's really appropriate because it's the Flash. So anyways, thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you guys later. This is John Blade 101 everybody, and I bid y'all good day. Have a good one.